Hello and welcome to Simply Southern. I'm Kevin Worthington. And I'm Mary Wilson. Dust off your boots and cowboy hat. The SLE Rodeo rides into Montgomery again next week. We'll talk with the cowgirl who heads it all up a little bit later. Children living with disabilities get the spotlight they deserve through a theater program that brings joy to both performers and audience members alike. Today on Simply Southern, we're taking you to a show that always gets rave reviews. And I'm Stacy Little. Today in the kitchen, I'm showing you how to make this super easy cream cheese bacon chicken pasta. Stay tuned. Over the years, we've told you about the benefits and the ease of getting locally grown food. Most people immediately think of produce when we mention things like Sweetgrown, in Alabama. But if you've been paying attention, we've also pointed out that you can buy meat from farmers in your area. Thousands of cattlemen produce beef on farms throughout Alabama, but it takes a local processor to bring beef from your area to your dining room table. Mason Hills is one of many processors in the state, but in some ways they're different from all the rest. Joseph Mason never saw himself as a farmer, much less the owner of a meat processing plant. But when he bought a farm in southern Mobile County, Joseph needed a way to get his cattle into the hands of consumers in the form of steaks and hamburgers. Farming, to me, has been a life-changing experience and I wouldn't have changed it for the world. And so we want to make an opportunity for people to win and to provide for their families. And so that's why we built this. And if you're not raising cattle, then you deserve an opportunity to come and eat clean beef. You deserve an opportunity to come eat clean chicken and clean pork and clean value-added products. Depending on the needs of the owner, Mason Hills dry ages their beef 14 to 21 days. They've only been operating a little over a year, but at peak production, the plant will be able to process 500 animals a month. We have uh, Herschel Burger, which is named after my dad. Uh, they're four ounce patties. Uh, we have Rooster Ridge Chicken Company, that's our chicken brand. We have Southern Gentleman Snack Stick Company, that is our snack stick line and going to be our smoke product line. And then we have Rangers Dog Food, uh, and that is our dog food line so that we're making sure that we're utilizing the whole animal. We're trying to be really good stewards of everything that we've been given, and we want to make sure that we don't waste anything. While most processing plants in Alabama fall under state regulations, Mason Hills is the only locally owned facility that's USDA inspected. Joseph says that gives consumers peace of mind, knowing their food has passed the most rigorous standards in the country. And Mason Hills works with farmers to help them improve the quality of the animals in their herd. Then we use artificial intelligence to grade the animal so that we can give you data back, important data, because you only have so much land and you only have so much time. And so if you come to us, we're gonna give you some data back that shows you maybe you need to change up your bull, maybe you need to change up your heifers a little bit so that whenever your customers that you want to return to you, they have an experience every time. And so we use artificial intelligence to grade the ribeyes. And so we can tell you if it's prime choice or select. And very soon, we'll be able to put on your package if it's certified USDA prime choice or select. Joseph says his goal is to give the consumer the best dining experience possible. With the opening of Four Bulls Market, it'll be even easier for consumers to buy their meats directly from the farmers who produce them. Pasture to Plate is such a passion for me because I know where the animal came from. I know what we're eating. Part of our mission statement says that we're good stewards of this place, ourselves and others. We've been afforded the opportunity to manage these resources and our families will eat here too and eat what we produce. And so it's important to me to know exactly where our animals come from, how they're raised. As the government and some other entities tighten up on a few things, having freedom to control your own food supply is going to be very important, I believe. Right now, the products produced under the Mason Hills banner are available primarily in the Mobile area, but they will ship their beef and pork to you. You can find their online store at masonhillfarms.com. And of course, whether it's beef, pork, produce, or any kind of farm fresh item, you can find products that were produced near you by visiting sweetgrownalabama.org. It's showtime. When Simply Southern returns, we're going to the theater to see a performance that will definitely have you requesting an encore.
Insurance and the related terminology can often be overwhelming, but we're here to help. There are two different types of auto insurance coverages, comprehensive and collision. Collision coverage protects your vehicle when involved in an accident, while comprehensive coverage includes protections for storm damage, theft, and windshield damage. Have questions about these options or whether you have sufficient coverage amounts? Just call your local Alpha agent or visit alphainsurance.com. These Alpha Insights are proudly presented by Alpha Insurance. No matter the herd you tend to, or the type of seeds you sow, Farm Bureau Bank understands the lifestyle and financial needs of our neighbors. We're here to help grow traditions, give back to agricultural communities, and offer financial convenience for your unique way of life. Whether it's personal or business, we are committed to serving you and your financial needs. Please give us a call and we'll get started today. A farmer has to live on faith. We do all we can do, but we can only control so much. Alabama is the second largest poultry growing state in the nation, so we're trying our best to grow all the corn we can for that. What we produce not only feeds and clothes all of the United States, but about half of what we make goes onto the world market. We've been able to improve yields, have some things that, that can help us produce a better crop. I'm proud of the product we make and proud that I can say I'm an Alabama farmer. In the heart of Alabama, where communities thrive and families flourish, there's a trusted partner with practical solutions for a better world. Alabama Extension equips farmers in the field and supports health in the home. Our experts extend knowledge and improve lives. We're growing food for our community right here in the city. We're gaining the confidence to become the leaders of tomorrow. We're here to help you grow and succeed in all aspects of life. Discover Alabama Extension at aces.edu.